And I think that the, the strange thing for me that's been challenging is that, so I'm, I'm trying to read the Bible and then think about it before to go to sleep, but, but I can't help. So instead of thinking about the things I'm reading about in the dollar store Bible, all I can think about is, is God judging me because I'm reading the dollar store Bible? <laughs> You know what I mean? Like, am I going to do all, like, am I going to do all this work and, like, get my spirit right and then die and then get up to heaven and God's just going to be like, like, dude, you could have afforded the $15 Bible, <laughs> the King James Standard. I was like, I, I don't know. And you, could, you could have just gone to church and stolen one and got it for free. <laughs> if you set foot in one church, you got one for, I would have forgiven you if you had talked to a priest about it and done your 48 Hail Marys. You wouldn't even have to give it back. I would have been like, hey, you earned it. Keep it, right? That's the... But I feel like what would happen is I would I'd do all this stuff and then i die and i get up there and, and God's going to go, the dollar store Bible. I mean, now you just got to sleep in your car for the rest of eternity. <laughs> I'd be like, what, no, no white pearly gate palace for me? He'd be like, no, you spiritually broke jerk. Should have coughed up for more of the Bible. Uh, you're going to be in your Nissan Versa for the rest of eternity. So have fun making friends in heaven, you loser. <laughs>